Hi, I'm Gary Gold and welcome to Voodoo Agent. Now, have you ever had a situation where you're talking to a buyer or seller lead and they say, you know, I'm not interested in buying right now, I'm gonna put it on the back burner, or you know what, we're not gonna list our house now, we're gonna wait till the kids are grown or whatever it is, and then two weeks later you see the house in the MLS listed or you run into them at the market and they go, we just bought a house, and it's like, congratulations. You know, this is very similar to like someone saying, you know, I'm really not interested in having a relationship right now. And then three weeks later, they're madly in love and they're going to get married to somebody. Why does this happen? Well, it happens because people, sometimes they just don't know. They're vulnerable. They're guarded. And they might say that, but they don't necessarily mean it. So why would someone say no when they really don't mean it? Well, there could be a bunch of reasons. Number one, they could be busy. Number two, the way you ask the question just to compel them. You could have nothing interesting to say to them. They might have something that they need to figure out. There could be other people involved that they need to talk to. They might have something they're not telling you, but none of those things necessarily mean no. So my suggestion to you when you get this situation, and you get this a lot, and the good agents understand this and delve. So next time you run into that situation where someone says, no, not now, number one, you have to ask follow-up questions. And if you ask follow-up questions, very possibly you could get that conversation going again. If that doesn't work, you can also say, hey, listen, I'm going to check in with you in 30 days. I'm going to check with you in two months. And you call, I've called people back the next day and the story is different. I, under, I recognize that. And the reason I recognize that is I'm the same way. And lastly, you could ask a very leading question saying, listen, if I find a property that's perfect for you and I think it's a really good value, should I call you? Or if I have a buyer who's just really anxious to buy a home and maybe we think we can get top dollar for your property, should I call you and maybe we'll show it? Those type of questions will really lead and you'll get to find out more. I'm Gary Gold. Thanks for tuning in to Voodoo Agent. And in an upcoming episode, I'm going to talk about how until you meet a lead, they are not your client. Thank you.